Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This video will uh, comprise of two things. Uh, one, I will quickly discuss the uh, uh, new changes that was imposed for um, guild habitats and what are the repercussions, the effects for uh, guild owners, habitat owners, and for us, the uh, harvesters or walkers. And then part two, part two of this um, video, guys, raffle of 12 Gino pets code so if i were you finish this video and check out your uh name if you will be picked okay so let's start so as you can see on the screen this was posted september 27 mainframe update harvest efficiency factor has been implemented for guild habitat so they put the link there if we go to the uh link this explains uh, more uh, clearly and uh, uh, more details was um, discussed. And as they said here, the main thing that guild habitat owners need to know is the decay for habitats will now be imposed per day. So 25% of the harvesting efficiency will happen per day. So for example, if you, um, for example, me, I have a, I was assigned uh, level two uh, habitat, regular habitat with a harvesting cap of 50 key. So if if my landlord, the owner of my habitat will not repair, 25% um, will be removed from my 50 key that I can harvest per day. So that will be 37.5. So again, if they won't repair the next day, it will go down to 25 because 50 percent of 50 is 25 so it's very massive in four days you can have a zero uh, rate which means your harvester or whoever will walk cannot gain any key anymore now uh, the good thing is if you repair say today you have at least two days before you can do another repair and it's stackable, meaning to say it can add up. So if you repair in advance, you can also have few days in advance that you cannot repair. So they gave here a very good example. Say uh, you repair today. It means your habitat can harvest maximum capacity within two days and the decay can only apply on the third day. So at least you have two days to uh, repair a habitat before it will start to remove 25%. So they said here when the guild's durability is zero, harvesting efficiency at is locked at 100% until the habitat expires into dormancy or upgrade. And at level, th level three, the player has the option to remove harvesting efficiency altogether if you want to spend 2,000 key. So again, level three guild habitats, if you want to invest 2,000 key and that will remove your harvesting efficiency. Meaning to say you can just uh, wait 90 days and another 90 days before you can start repairing. But again, it will cost you 2,000 and key. Um, I know that this has been a... Uh, there's there's been a big blow there's been a big blow for guild habitats in terms of uh repairing but before we proceed to the repercussions as you can see here i'm opening the uh, mainframe um there are now options here for the um uh quick action to refine crystals by volume you can repair habitats by volume so you don't need to do it one by one i think this is one of the new features that was just introduced for habitat owners and then you can also filter if you have different type of habitats which habitat you want to um, uh, perform actions or you can sort it as well as per level and you can also sort if it per alchemist or per harvester so yeah for the repercussions um, again it's very clear um, the, the daily cap will uh, be changed and of course, for us, the walkers, we can only we can only do much depending on how our landlord or the guilds will repair your um, habitat. In YGG, there's been a uh, big 
uh, discussions. Uh, it's heated conversations. There were uh, people who are really uh, suggesting to repair the habitats because we want to maximize the harvesting of tea. But take note, guys, um, come next week, it will not be easy to harvest the required energy. Like again, I will um, use my, 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 my habitat here, level two. I need 2,500 energy per day to meet the 50 key. And come next week after the new uh, requirement of the steps to bank energy, I will need at least 10,000 to 11,000 steps per day just to hit that 2,500 uh, energy. And I have nothing left to upgrade my uh, Gino pet. So that will be tough for most of us. Uh, if you have spare time, you have huge time to walk, then this is good for you. But for uh, regular people with a lot of uh, tasks on the side, it will be hard. So for me, 10,000 is okay because I have other energy. As you know, I'm doing um, Stepan as well. 10,000 for me is just my average. But obviously, not every day I will be able to hit that. So uh, yeah, I guess the guilds are having issues now, um, including us, the walkers, how this will eventually affect us. We will know soon. But again, all I can say is uh, the uh, recommendation is use your uh, unused energy to level up your pets because they will reset everything come Monday and we don't know the calculation yet how many energy uh, will be left or XP in your account. So yes, for me, I'm targeting level 10 come Monday and use all the energy that I have and convert it into XP. Okay, guys, that's it for the habitat. Now let's go to the, um, let's go to the raffle. As you can see here on this um, video, why Genopets step to energy efficiency update delayed. I told you to use the word or comment the word energy in the comment section so you can be part of the YouTube random comment picker. All right. So again, if you will not win this one, please keep trying. Go to Discord. Go to Twitter. There's a lot of influencers that give away codes. And I'm trying my best to get the next batch as soon as I can. So if you will be picked, if your name will be picked, Email me, kikapi at gmail.com. I will give you an instruction there. I will give you a specific word to comment on the YouTube channel to verify. So as simple as that, again, if you will be picked here, email me, kikapi at gmail.com. Also, I will include the codes that was not claimed in our previous video. So again, also in the next video, if some codes will not be... Uh, uh, will not be taken or will not be claimed by the time I upload a new video. Uh, so be it, I will need to raffle again because I cannot keep the codes too long. So many of you are dying to have it. And of course, we want to you to have the pet straight away. I'll, I hope that's loud and clear. Let's go. Good luck to all of you. I'll be picking 12. Winner number one. Cheryl Gundert. Energy insightful, thank you. So winner number one, Cheryl. Winner number two, Dacon. They can take their time, no need to rush things. I've got I've got plenty of energy to wait for them to build something great. Okay, winner number three. Vishal Patel energy. Winner number four. Crypto Investor Energy. Winner number five. Baker, Baker Arroy. Uh, energy is what I need. Thanks. Uh, second time winner. Very lucky. Very lucky. Winner number six. Claire Santos Energy. Winner number seven. Side Hustle NFT Games. Hello po. Pa shout out naman. He he he. Obviously, he's Filipino now. This is your shout out, side hustle. Congratulations. Uh, winner number nine, Joseph Francic. Hope to get that code energy. Winner number 10, Miguel Simbulan, spreading a positive energy. Good luck to us. 
Winner number 11. The road. Energy is king. Okay. And the last but not the least. Winner number 12. Gustavo Algave Sierra. Energy. I hope I get a code. I watch all your videos. Okay, guys. That's it. Thank you so much. Email me. Kikapi at gmail.com and I will tell you an instruction what to comment on this video. Until next time, guys, let's go and terraform.